Good morning. Are we going down the stairs on your bottom? Well, can you count? One. When I started my channel, I did not have a clue how to vlog. And I don't wear slippers, so you get this nice view of my feet on a cold morning's vlog. Usually there's pop tarts in here, but they're all taken. The first thing I'll reach for in the kitchen, apart from a plate, is this one. The cereal drawer. We have an array here. Wheat of extra juicy cordies. These are canes that I got because he does actually like fruity flavoured cereals. These are just from the baby out, but he has had them before. Cookies, cocoa pops. These are what he was eating, which are very similar. Cheerios, Frosties, Crumpets. He will eat Crumpets as well. He would also always have a yogurt with whatever he's eating. That's those. I don't normally tend to have breakfast. So I'll just rummage through snacks up and see what happens to him. And obviously I like time bars because they're all gone. I'm going to call mine. I don't need to head over to this section because I don't drink that. It'll always be. Obviously if you guys live in the UK, the first thing you'll probably do like me is put the boiler on because it is absolutely thrilling and that would be whacked up to the max here guys. The I will max. place down the breakfast and call on the child. I okay. put my eye down because I'm sick of looking like a tramp and at least this looks a little bit better. So every day after having breakfast, um, we will just hover around the house if we're not going anywhere. Um, buses against thing he'll watch buses he'll watch something called tic tac on cbb's and he'll watch the same things he'll ask jay to rewind it and then rewind it again and rewind it again sometimes he might wander towards his toy cars or he might wander to a few books he likes to read but other than that he's trying to say do you want to do this king do you want to do this king do you want to do this and he's like no I want to watch me buses leave me be so yeah that's how the mornings nearly go and then when it gets to around 11 I start to pick up whatever he's had out and then I put in dinner usually if we're not going anywhere. But I think we are going to Dobby's today. So we'll probably be out a bit before then because I think the big kids are too old to play in play areas, which is hard when you have big and little kids to find something to do. But they're going to have food wise. It's my little creation. This is a cat, so he's got two pointy ears, two eyes, a nose, a mouth, and then he's got some whiskers going on here. Look how I like that. There we are. Cody did this. I think he basically just put every sprinkle on his biscuit. Whoa. Sprinkle, sprinkle all the way. As for the two cows, they're lazy. It's past... It's at, what time is that, Cody? 20 past nine and they're still in bed. Keen is just having a play with cars. He's been very good. Keeny. And the weather is rainy and dull. The art of den building is upon us. Oh. plan was this a clock tower and we have it completed and worked together and made we need to make a clock so we've got two arrows do a circle you cut this out cord it's exactly the same three along and two up or is it three up oh it's three up we have the roof and we even have a little homemade clock tower how cool is that well done, Cords. Well done, me. Whee. Charity shop haul today. Well, all the things are on half price in the charity shop. And look at these. Got a little hedgehog, 50 pence. A squirrel, oh, 50 pence. Another squirrel, 50 pence. And another polar bear, 50 pence. Another polar, 50 pence. And a penguin, 50 pence. All that was like three quid. Come on, that's just brilliant. I added the little white animals I got this morning to my tree. There's another one. Where's another? Ta da! And another. So it looks like that now. I definitely need some more of them. I like them. Look at this one green here. Like this look. Give me that pen. Ooh, that's pretty. Oh man, you do it. Oh, that's beautiful. In the tree. Oh, yeah. This was from the one stop near us. It was a pound and it's got loads of little activities in for them. So I picked that up the other day. I think Key's using it the most, like. And me. It's got all sorts in. It's got a recipe too. These things here under the tree are actually the Christmas Eve boxes all ready for them. And the pump. The time Paul's on from work, about four o'clock, this house will not be like this. I'll probably have to start everything I've just done again.
popped to the town and Coupland's is very festive at the minute. Look at all these bakes. I actually got the logs and the gingerbreads and look at these shoes. They're like little sleeping bags for your feet. These are from H&M. They had loads of knitted things in there, stuff that was right up my street. So I just thought I'd share a few of the things that I liked. This orange top and them jeans were really nice as well. Loads of cardigans. And I like this, it was like collared and it was quite long, so like a knitted dress. Then Kane had a little play in this play bit that is in the town centre, but he played with the chair more than anything else, but he really enjoyed himself, he was running all over. And that is the ingenuity bread, which was nice. These were way too sweet, I did not like them, Paul didn't, the other kids didn't. The only kid who ate them was actually Megan. It had marzipan in the middle of it and then like a chocolate filling and chocolate around, it was way too sweet. Then we headed to... Well, the park, which is near Seaton, which the arcades are near there on the seafront, so we went there as well. It wasn't too bad today. It was a bit windy, but it was quite a nice day compared to all the snow that we've had. And obviously, I got stuck on this, you can see. Christmas ones! Something out. Oh, are you going in the donuts, King? Let's go. Oh, do you spin faster, faster? Whoa! Turn in the hole. I know it doesn't some cleaning yes it's a hard knock life for me it's a hard knock life for me instead of kisses i get moans instead of hugs i get groans it's a hard knock life don't it feel like your purse is always empty don't it feel like you never want to smile every day is the same and same again i can't put up with this anymore ah. clean and sparkly and the two boys have been washed and they've also had this in the Nearly half four and me and Keen's been watching Dip Dab for a while, haven't we Keen? Is it good? And we've been drawn loads of pictures I've been drawn of it. So this has kept me entertained. I've done hundreds. Because it's like a little drawn cartoon. Yeah. And he's all my pictures. On this episode he was minding a crying baby that kept getting woken up by noises. And that's a good start. And then he had a rabbit on one and the snow globe one was really good. I enjoyed that episode. Have we been doing all these pictures? And he's still watching Dip Dab. And it's not long before tea, so Paul should be headed on soon. Look how dark it is for half four. Dip Dab! He really likes this show. And he's been loving me drawing. He's been watching everything I've done. It's family games night. Are we ready? No. Because all the clothes are not. Well, just the clothes then. We have the poison donut. Oh well, then. <coughs> and the grand man. No. <laughs> what? No, I don't. Well, that's the answer. Ah! No, it isn't, because at least could have any one of them. Oh, for God's sake, not point two seven five percent chance. Not point two four percent chance that I will win. I'm excited. Are we then, Sky? Your turn. Oh! <laughs> Oh, yeah. Saxophone, how do you know? She was going to say that. <laughs> okay, goodness me. <laughs> it seems like something she wouldn't be able to read. Bent manner. Who's this to? Bent oh, manner. Oh, two. <laughs> Don't be no. Ow! Oh, two. I'm going to. Oh, two. Stop you, me. Oh, two. You. Yeah. <laughs> oh, come on. And this was the game, sorry. <laughs> no. And, and some oh. farted. Actually. <laughs> <laughs> 
that's about it. So thanks for watching and have yourself a very Merry Christmas.